Hi, mathematicians. In this math read aloud, I have a story to read to you and then a math challenge problem for you to solve at the end of the story. This story is called Two Eggs, Please. It is written by Sarah Weeks and illustrated by Betsy Lewin. Two eggs, please. What'll it be? Two eggs, please. Sunny side up. Two eggs, please. Over easy. Hmm, different. Two eggs, please. Scrambled. Two eggs, please. Soft boiled for me, hard boiled for him. Two eggs on a roll, please. Hmm, different. Two eggs, please. Fried, side of bacon, hash browns, corn muffin, sausage, OJ, and a lightly toasted sesame seed bagel with cream cheese, no butter. Two eggs, please. Poached. My friend here would like a couple of raw ones, if you wouldn't mind. Hmm, different. Two sunny side up, two over easy, two scrambled, two soft boiled, two hard boiled, two on a roll, two fried, two poached, two raw. Oh, that's a lot of eggs. Different, the same. Two eggs coming up. Different, but the same. All right, mathematicians, here is your math challenge problem. If everyone in your home ordered two eggs, how many eggs would that be in all? Write a math sentence that represents your answer. Here's an example from my home. I have six people in my family. My husband, my daughter, my son, my dad, my mom, and me. If each of us ordered two eggs, how many would that be all together? Six people ordering two eggs. Did you say 12? That's right. Now, what math sentence could we write to represent that answer? 12 eggs. Six people, two eggs each, 12 eggs. In the past, students have told me that two plus two plus two plus two plus two plus two, plus two equals 12. They added two six times because there are six people. Another equation I have heard is six plus six equals 12. They have one group of six, so each person gets one egg, and then another group of six. Each person gets another egg. So six plus six, that's like two groups of six, is the same as 12. I've also heard this equation. Six groups of two equals 12 or six times two equals 12. That's like thinking about six groups. So each person is a group. There are six groups, and each of those groups, each of those people gets two eggs. Six groups of two eggs is 12. This equation in purple, six times two, is related to the blue equation. 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2, adding 2 six times, because you can see those groups of six. For example, each of these is a group or a person. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. You can see those six groups, and there's two eggs for each group, so six groups of two. Another equation I've heard before from students is two times six equals 12. It's like two eggs 
or six people. It's almost like one group of six. So one group of eggs for each person and then two groups, a second group of six. So this green equation is related to the pink one. Two groups of six is like thinking about six plus six equals 12. All right, mathematicians, I can't wait for you to try this challenge. Thank you so much for listening.